Hey guys, how's it going? It's me, Richie Plunkett from the Pop Dome Geek, and I'm here with another unboxing video of the PX5 headphones for the PS3 by Turtle Beach. So let's check them out. Now, just to firstly start off with, I've been looking for a pair of headphones for quite a while now, and I know there's a lot out there in the market. Um, they, there's obviously the Turtle Beach headphones, which range from different prices. Uh, obviously, these I think are the top top of the line ones, and then they go down. Um, for wired headsets. Now these are the wireless ones and then they're the Astro A40s which are the next I think the best competitive headphones out there um, which I do like um, but I'm only interested in wireless. Um, I'm not really interested in the wired ones. As I have too many wires already on my desk. Uh, I don't need more. Now the thing is the Astros do have a wireless gaming headset but it's not really wireless so I'm not too sure why they even called it wireless. Like you still gotta hook up you know like a wire right there which controls the volume, which controls everything else, but it's not really wireless is it? It's not a wireless headset, it's a headset with a wire on it, um, which is wireless, um, if that makes sense. But there's also now people are, you know, sort of saying, oh, why'd you get virtual surround sound, which is also another dispute um, between true surround sound. Now, if I wanted to spend money on a true surround head, you know, headset, I would just go buy, you know, a surround sound system. Um, that's why. So if I really want true surround sound. Now the thing is, um, there's also the Sennheisers which is out there which you also can check them out. Um, but they are a lot more expensive which I don't recommend. And they don't have the features which the Turtle Beach have. Which is such as, you know, streaming music straight to your headphones through Bluetooth. Um, you can connect through Bluetooth to your PlayStation and also to your phone. So you can actually have, you know, two, there's two transmitters in there which you can talk while gaming. Now there's also other features in there, in this headset which I'll talk about later on in other videos. Now this is just an unboxing video so let's go straight into it. Okay so, <clears throat> let's get into this. Now I realised that the camera just went a little bit yellow, I have no clue why. Um, but it doesn't matter, does it? Now I think this is the actual first, the first unboxing video of these headphones on YouTube. I'm not too sure, but there they are. Um, nothing really special about the box. You know, it's just the box. This, this is interesting. That was inside the box right there. Put that off to the side. Okay, let's go one by one. Now you got a pretty decent manual in here. Which um, the user guide, which talks about everything, I assume about PX5. So now you obviously get the PX5 headset, the USB programming cable, Xbox Live cable, two AA batteries. Um, now the digital transmitter, USB cable, optical cable, also, which is really good. Um, I'm really happy with that. Um, makes makes it easier for me that I don't have to buy optical cable. Now they obviously show you also how to connect. Uh, to your PS3 and Xbox and the different settings but and how to pair it and so forth but we'll leave that up the side Let's see what's inside the box you got a double industry batteries this normal alkaline I'll probably recommend getting a pair of rechargeable batteries I'm sort of not really disappointed, but you know, I do wish they sort of made it as a dock, like as a, a whole rechargeable headset. That would be really impressive. There's nothing else in there. Because um, they did say they sort of improved this headphone, or this headset, sorry, from you know users' comments and um, you know what people wanted, what the user wanted. Um, but I guess they couldn't put in a rechargeable headset. <laughs> anyway, so you got you know your USB cable right there. Pretty decent length for that. Um, not too sure what that's for. Okay, now this is, I assume this is to connect the Xbox, which is handy, which I don't have. But so USB cable, or power cable, or I think this is the transmitter cable. I think so. 
and then you got your optical cable which is pretty thin might I say and your AA batteries so put that off to the side and let's get into what we want most headphones okay this is talk about oh this is just showing the different presets and then what the ear cups have on them like the volume the mic mute button game volume Oh, so it's sort of like a little hint card, which has everything on there. That's actually pretty cool. Nice little sticker right there. I play like a pro. Stop. In the name of me. I guess this is warranty purposes. Yep, this is for warranty. So that's cool. Just check it out on the back. On the back, they show you how to connect um, the headset all together and so forth. But we can connect that later on. Okay, let's take this out. Very nice. Uh, well, this feels really light. Now, I've never owned any Turtle Beach headphones, so this is my first headphones by Turtle Beach. And I must say, it's really impressive. Sorry about the squeaky chair. Gotta put some oil in that. Okay, wow. Okay, this feels really... A little bit plasticky, but that's alright. I mean, it does what it does. It's actually quite small. I was expecting it to be quite big. Now let's take a closer look. Right there, there's the front. There's the back right there. Get your power button. Very cool. Now the headphones. Now I do assume this this headphone jack does come off. Maybe not. I don't know. Oh yeah, here we go. Yeah, so I wish this actually came off the physical jack instead of just this. But that's alright. Just tuck that back on there. Now, got some plastic. That off. Now, I must say, just feeling the material of the headphones, it does feel pretty good. Like a, a, a decent quality. You know, you, you feel like you sp you know spent your money well. That's one thing for sure. Um, the material in this feels really nice. I'm sure that's going to be nice on the head while playing for long hours. Like that is really comfy. So I should give a closer look. Now these are supposed to cup. Oh, there we go. Yeah. Yeah. There's the headphones. Then you got all your settings in the back, on the bottom actually, should I say. Okay, I'm going to try these on, let's see. So that just sits like that. Voila. Yeah, so that's there the unboxing video of the PX5 Turtle Beach headphones for the PlayStation 3. Um, hope you guys enjoyed that. Very comfy. <laughs> that's what I can say. Yeah, that is very nice. But anyways, um, subscribe for more videos. Uh, I'll be posting up an overview or a first impression video while I test this out. And then later on, probably next week, um, once I actually gave these headphones a good test for its money, uh, I'll put up a review and I'll post it up on here. So make sure you subscribe to check out that video. And I'll catch you guys later.